Welcome to AmeenAcademy.com. In physics, let us discuss about different terms in oscillatory motion. What is periodic motion? Motions processes, motion possesses a phenomena which repeat themselves at a regular intervals are called periodic. Oscillatory motion. The motion of your body is said to be oscillatory motion if it travels to and fro about a fixed point after regular intervals of time. It's a good example of pendulum, clock pendulum. The fixed point about the about which the body oscillates is called the mean position or equilibrium position. Next, simple harmonic motion. Simple harmonic motion is a special type of periodic oscillatory motion in which the particle oscillates on a straight line. The acceleration of a particle is always directed towards a fixed point on the line. That is a, on the fixed line. The magnitude of acceleration is proportional to its displacement of the particle from the extreme position. From extreme to mean position, the acceleration is increasing. Characteristics of SHM. The displacement x in SHM at time t is given by x equal to a sine of omega t plus phi, where the three constants a, omega and phi characterizes the SHM. They distinguish on SHM from another. A SHM can also be described by a cosine function as follows a x equal to a cos omega t plus delta. The displacement of an oscillating particle at any instant is equal to the change of its position vector during the time. That means what at the displacement is, is a function of time. The maximum value of the displacement in an oscillatory motion on either side of a mean position is called displacement or amplitude or simply amplitude. That means from mean position to the extreme position, the horizontal distance is a amplitude. The amplitude is A, that is x maximum. x maximum is a amplitude. The time taken by an oscillating particle to complete one full oscillation to and fro about its mean equilibrium position is called the time period. That is time taken to complete one oscillation is called a time period. It is given by the function uh, time t. Here, another model. This uh, mass is staying on a horizontal plane and one end is fixed with the spring with Prince constant k and oscillate horizontally. That is here minus negative position of a and positive, negative, positive position of a both together forms a amplitude x is the main position x equals zero is the main position frequency <clears throat> the number of oscillations in one second is called the frequency frequency it is expressed in per second or hertz frequency and time period are independent of amplitude how big the amplitude it won't affect the time period the Angular frequency omega equal to 2 pi by t. Phase. The quantity omega t plus phi is called a phase of SHM at time t. It uh, describes the state of motion at the instant. The quantity phi is the phase at time t equal 0 and is called the phase constant or initial phase or epoch of the SHM. The phase constant is the time dependent, time independent term of the cosine or sine function. Time will not affect the phase angle. Here, look at here the figure. The force responsible for maintaining SHM is called the restoring forces. If the displacement x from the equilibrium position is small, the restoring force f acting on the body is given by f equal to minus kx, where k is the force constant and f is the force, spring constant. 
Force constant means spinning constant, x is the displacement. Energy in SHM. When a body executes SHM, its energy changes between kinetic and potential, but the total energy is always constant. At any time x, any displacement x from the equilibrium position, that is here mean position, here extreme left position, extreme right position, xt, that is a function of time, function of x with respect to time is a cos omega t plus phi. Here, omega x of t is displacement, a is amplitude, cos omega t is angular frequency, cos omega t plus phi, where omega t is angular frequency, phi is a phase constant. Then here, omega t plus phi is a phase. Spring in series. If two springs have spring constant k1 and k2 are joined in series, the spring constant of the combination is given by and series means it is 1 by k equal 1 by k1 plus 1 by k2. Now in spring in series parallel, if two springs have spring constant k1 and k2 are joined in parallel, the spring constant of the combination is given by k equal to k1 plus k2. When one spring is attached to two masses m1 and m2, then considering together mass is called m equal to m1 plus m2 and apply in the formula. Now we will discuss about simple pendulum. A simple pendulum is the most common example of bodies executing SHM. That is for uh, we can say a clock pendulum is a good example for simple pendulum which, which executes SHM, simple harmonic motion. An ideal simple pendulum consists of a heavy body, point mass body suspended by a weightless, in, in extensible and perfectly flexible string from rigid support about which it is free to oscillate. The time period of simple pendulum of length L is given by, look at here first, here the fixed point is vertical position here, now the bob is here, that mass, it is in that some position other than the mean position, then mass is, is mg cos theta along the, along the string and perpendicular to the string is mg sin theta. Here m is in vertical is mg, mg means force. The time period of a simple pendulum depends on the length of the pendulum and acceleration due to gravity. Time pendulum depends only the length of the pendulum as well as acceleration of the gravity, not other things. A second pendulum is a pendulum whose time period is 2 seconds. So it takes totally 2 seconds to complete one oscillation, it is called a second pendulum. At a place where g is 9.8 meter per second square, the length of second pendulum is found to be nearly 99.3 centimeter, nearly 1 meter. If a liquid of density P oscillates in a vertical U tube of uniform cross sectional area A, then the time period of the oscillation is given by T equal to 2 pi root L by G. This is for simple pendulum formula, time period formula is T equal to 2 pi root of L by G. And a cylinder of mass M, length L, density of material P, and uniform area of cross section A oscillates vertically in a liquid of density rho, then the time period of the oscillation is given by. We can use the things in the yeah, formula. Undamped, undamped simple harmonic motion. Undamped simple harmonic motion means when a simple harmonic system oscillates with a constant amplitude, amplitude which does not change with time. Its oscillations are called undamped simple harmonic motions. So outside forces is not affecting other than gravitational force. That means uh, it is undamped. Damped simple harmonic oscillations, which means when a simple harmonic system oscillates with a decreasing amplitude with time, its oscillations are called damped simple harmonic oscillations. The angular frequency of the damped oscillator is given by differential equation that is m dx square x over dt square plus b dx by dt plus kx equals 0. 
A system is set to execute free oscillation if on being displaced or disturbed from its position of equilibrium, it oscillates itself without outside interference. When a system is compelled to oscillate with a frequency other than the natural frequency, it is said to be exude force oscillation. Suppose you are giving external force to this block, it is called forced oscillation. The external force which causes forced oscillation is to is of sinusoidal nature. It is given as look at here. Suppose here that block is further it's connected with the damp with which liquid connected with the plate then which is damped. It's a resonance, resonance is the phenomena of setting a body into oscillation with large amplitude, large amplitude under the influence of some external periods, periodics, force, whose frequency is exactly equal to the natural frequency of the given body. Such oscillations are called resonant oscillations. The two or more oscillations linked together in such a way that the exchange of energy takes place between them are called coupled oscillators. The oscillators produced by coupled oscillators are known as coupled oscillations. The speed of the mechanic wave depends upon the properties of the medium in which it is traveling. Where E is the elastic constant and rho is the density of the medium then the speed of the wave is given by ET energy with respect time or half into K A square E power minus B T over M. Some important note, periodic motion we know that oscillatory or vibratory motion and simple harmonic motion in that time period frequency all we discussed. We have done. Please subscribe our YouTube channel.